All right, this decode is going to be on the Truman Show and how it connects to Harry as Truman, the 33rd U.S. president. <laughs> so to start off, the Truman Show, um, a movie starring Jim Carrey. This movie was released 33 weeks before Jim Carrey's birthday. Again, Harry S. Truman was the 33rd U.S. president and who was a Freemason, Freemasonry, or excuse me, Masonry equals 33 in the most pure cipher and 33 degrees in Scottish Rite Freemasonry, and in fact, yes, Harry S. Truman was a 33rd degree Freemason, and he became a 33rd degree Mason in the month of October. Um, and October is the only month equating the 33 in Gematra, in the four base ciphers, that is. It, it's just, <laughs> uh, already funny, but, um, Secrecy also equals 33, you know, secret society, masonry. Um, and Jesuitic also 33 because masonry, modern day Freemasonry, controlled by the Jesuits, no doubt can be easily proven. Um, so yeah. And, uh, Oh yeah, and it's said that when someone gets to be a 33rd degree Mason, that they are given the true secrets of Freemasonry, like Albert Pike said, and many more. Um, and having said this, it, I, I, I just don't think it's an accident that the month Harry S. Truman became a 33rd degree, it, or was in October. And this is because October and secrecy are a match in all the base ciphers. And there are four base ciphers, so that's pretty uh pretty concrete. So yeah, um and I feel like October's kind of has this is it's like a kind of a ritualistic m type month. If you think about it, because you got Halloween in it, um, and I think Friday the 13th, yeah, Friday the 13th originated from stuff with the Templars, and which was in the month of October. Um, so yeah, and... Just to continue, the Truman Show came out 118 days before the Jesuit Order's birthday. And Jim Carrey's real first and last name, James Carrey, equals 118. Because, okay, because if you watch, I, I actually rewatched the movie recently. There's a lot of, um, or not a lot, but there's some, if you have a good eye to catch some stuff. There's some, there's a few numbers that connect to the Society of Jesus, and there's a little bit, there's some stuff with the sun, too, um, that connect, which goes back to the Society of Jesus, so th there's kind of, um, there's, there's kind of a, um, nod, if you will, to, in the, movie to uh the Jesuits um with a few things but anyways um and Truman Show just Truman Show without the in it Truman Show equates to one eighteen so yeah um and then also it came out this movie came out on the hundred and fifty second day of the year and <laughs> Just Truman Show equals 152. Um, also, the movie came out 24 days after President Truman's birthday, or what would have been. Yeah, because 
I don't, no, nah, I don't think he was alive. No, I don't think he was alive at that time. Um, and Truman equals 24. And the last name of the main character in the movie, of course, Truman. And his last name, Burbank. Burbank equals 24. Uh, the movie came out 157 days after Harry is Truman's death. And Harry Truman equals 157. Just um, already proving how synced up with him. But to continue, Harry Truman died 133 days after his birthday. President, as he was the President of the United States. President equals 133. Government 133. And in addition, the CIA was established while Harry S. Truman was in office. And the CIA was established 133 days after Harry Truman's birthday. Can you believe it? And this was because Harry Truman signed the National Security Act of 1947 into law with that phrase, the National Security Act equals 133. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, it, it's just concrete. And um, back to Harry S. Truman being a Freemason, his birthday, who, who knows if that's really his birthday, or who knows if this is really his birthday, but his birthday is May 8th, written 5 slash 8, Harry Truman equals 58. And Freemasonry, 58. So, just laughable. Um, but yeah, that was, that was all I had to present. Thank you guys for watching, and I'm out. Peace.